be fun to actually get up onto the sets. And one thing like to think about it, but to be in the environment where you're surrounded by the sets and everyone else around you is actually treating you like Superman, like that's that'll be <laughs> that'll be the whole kind of like oh. Are you trying to see it on yet? I'm not going to see it on yet. Not yet. I know. I know. So it'll be it'll be fun though. I'm excited for it. It's going to make it feel a little bit more real. How was the process of getting the role? Um, this was. I don't know why they were so nice. To me. This was like one of the easiest uh, experiences I've had as far as getting a job. I had, I had a great meeting with Jake Delancey and Andrew over there. And, um, it was just we had a kind of common. Um, Common love with certain things about the character, um, different things about his personality and what makes him him, and, uh, you know, the responsibilities he has, things like that. So uh, we just kind of hit it off about that, and there was that meeting, and that was it. So we were going to go a couple days later that we were going to go forward, and we were like, yeah, yeah, So, yeah. How's your preparation been to coming Workout routine and the diet is similar. Uh, <laughs> back to that. Uh, had a good couple of years away from it to kind of relax. But yeah, back to that. Um, but as far as the character, I think you know I'm just approaching it the way I do any other character. Um, the thinking about Superman. I, Superman is a symbol. It you know, represents that and kind of what he stands for. But uh, for me, I'm kind of just trying to treat it like, well, that's the suit he wears to work. It's, it's what anybody else does. So um, he does what he does, and that's what he wears. So um, I'm trying to find who the guy is, what makes him sick, uh, you know, the way that he responds to different people, things like that. That's, that's more of the focus. Think, so. On your personal journey with your man, how was that? Uh, personal journey? Yeah. Um, really, yeah, yeah. No, I, I, it was definitely one that I used to buy. Like, God, I, I watched the King. <laughs> Um, and it just—I mean, yeah—he's such a, it's such an iconic symbol of you know, like American culture, of world culture, really. Now, I mean, it's just, um, it's, like I said, very surreal to think. Like driving in the car when I got the call, and my little brother was like, so you, "You're playing Superman." <laughs> I guess I am. It's so weird. It's never, it's like it's not. It's not a sense you really think about. Very often, so it's uh, it's still hitting me. Like, um, yeah, just same thing. Kind of finding, you know, it's like any. I think anybody, uh, different social settings or situations or whatever. You kind of have different parts of your personality that stand out more. more so, uh, you know, just finding the differences in that, seeing which parts are. Which parts will come out more when you sit in? Which parts come out more when it's hard? It'll be the most fun thing to play with, for sure. Have you had any conversations with Henry Cavill? Uh, I've not had any conversations with Henry, no. Uh, I got a bunch of friends who are just finished working with him, but I uh, haven't talked to him yet, so uh, we'll see, I'm sure. I ran into uh, Brandon Ralph the other night uh, at a party, and uh, so that was kind of like a weird, like, oh, hey, yeah, cool. Did you get it? Um, so, yeah, yeah I'm, sure, I'm sure I'll run into Henry as well. Any word on whether you will be a major like crossover with the Thor show? They don't tell me things. <laughs> <laughs> Mainly so I can't ruin it on here. So. <laughs> it's for the best. It's like a don't ask, don't tell kind of thing. Yeah. So, how do you think your portrayal of Superman differs from this? Um, I haven't shot it yet, so I don't know. Um, but I think you know, just the, the tone of the show seems to be really different. Uh, obviously, the, the latest ones have been a little bit darker and more heavier. This one is it's so full of light and hope and optimism. And I, I kind of think, you know, especially just certain things that have been going on lately, I, I, I'm actually really excited about the fact that the show takes that tone and it does offer that that kind of an outlet. Um, and, you know, enough negative stuff on TV and movies. And, and I'm I'm not gonna lie, I enjoy doing those films and telling those stories as well, but it's nice to be a part of something that is very uplifting and helpful. Yeah.